you just had a fantastic match and you want to look it over. You want to see your sick quadra kill, your sick dodge of a decker bomb, and your sick Murdoch snipe to secure the win. You also want to look back, because you are a good student, and learn from your mistakes. But there's just one problem. How exactly do you use Paragon's replay system? <laughs> Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very quick Paragon Guide. I am Silphan. So when you guys open up Paragon, you go to the Watch tab right here to look at replays. Now the very first tab you'll see is Paragon TV. That is where the, in, the, the client kind of features some matches that you can kind of see for yourself. Usually it has the highest number of viewers over here and you can see there's one viewer in this match if you go over here there's a featured there is a featured screen with usually some uh s some key community members usually that are in here some maybe high skill games in here as well and maybe some random matches in here as well recent here is some very recent matches that just happened just very recently you can see this one happened 49 minutes ago 21 minutes ago this one here is one that you're probably the most interested in and this is personal this is all of your replays that go out to 15 days ago as as 15 days is the longest that a replay will stay in the system so you can see here my latest match was actually three days ago going back quite a while now the next one here is a friends tab that takes a while to load this friends tab is all of the matches that your friends uh ha have done and if you go over here i have a gazillion of them so that's why this one's going to load there is you have to you have to pay attention though is that it is fairly buggy and it will kind of be stuck loading this if you go and and you have that problem the next very important one is this search tab if you go back over here and click on one of the things see you can see here that's going to be loading for forever now if you click on it you will get a replay id when you can copy that paste it in here and you can actually search for a specific replay and you can get that and watch any game that has been in the last 15 days now when you are about to watch a replay you have some options if it is not a live game you can play from right from the beginning including the draft lobby or you can skip the draft lobby we're going to do this and get into the some of the in-game features while you are using the replay system now once you load into the replay it's not overly complicated and we won't go into crazy depth about the replay system now you will immediately see on both sides that you have your teams your blue team on the left and the orange team on the right now up in the top you have some camera types you have a drone that you can use to the that you can use your aswd keys or your on on on, on the ps4 your controller to to control the position of the camera and with your other with your mouse and your other mouse pad you can you can use it to do this you can also zoom in and you can also zoom out if you so like now there are some other options there is the hero chase so i click that and you can see that actually follows me right here this is one the one of my replays that it, you can see me here and it follows me around again you can zoom in out wasd doesn't do anything but you can use your mouse to circle around if you want to keep your 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 the camera facing a certain direction now from here you can you can change the general options with foliage on or off as you can see that just kind of helps out your vision you can also do auto which which may which which makes it able to move the camera around or you go free and that brings it back to the position that that uh or auto sorry is the position that that my hero is facing free is whatever now moba is one that i don't really use personally because as you can see it's kind of top down and we can kind of probably change foliage on and off but as you can see it really doesn't do very much so moba is a kind of traditional moba uh moba view and as you can see you can zoom in and out again you can change the the direction of uh, of the camera uh but this is is, is a fairly 
finicky um, <laughs> view as you can see here. Now, you can also change the camera types by using the one, two, three um, buttons on your numpad. You can use that as well. It is up to you. Now, oh, down here, you above your experience and uh, card power lobes, you have different options as well. You can, on your replay bar here, you can have kills, where you can see in, in the red bars the kills. You can, you can see your deaths on here. It does take a little bit to load here on the purple, you can see, are, are, are my deaths. You can click this one to see the tower kills will appear as well. And a damage, where a little green bar is here, a little bar graph uh, shows up with the amount of damage relative to the highest amount um, that you deal. This lock button, you can turn it off so that the whole thing disappears, make a nice more cinematic approach. Uh, you can you can go full back and forward 10 seconds in the replay uh, while also pausing it with the P button or that button down in here. Now here over here, you can see uh, you can go all the way from 10, 0.10 times speed all the way up to four times the replay speed. Now over here is actually really interesting in that you can uh, start recording, clear the recording, and send it or send it to YouTube or create a GIF. Very, very interesting uh, option there if you want to kind of share your, your, your in-game experience with people. That is about it. Some other small things is that control on your keyboard also changes the camera type, uh, just cycles, cycles through them. And H is the key for you to remove the HUD if you want a super cinematic experience while you are watching. You can either go from nothing at all to health bars to the actual UI on screen. Guys, that's really about it. That's kind of the general overview. I think that there are some more finer details, but personally as a content creator, I don't use much more than this. Please, ladies and gentlemen, like this video if you like it, dislike if you dislike it, please share it with the community if you guys are uh, want to share this guide and of course subscribe if you guys find this content enjoyable find it useful please subscribe so i can do it for you in the future till next time like always stay optimistic and positive